interference of waves. When two or more waves meet, they interact with each other. Interference is a phenomenon in which waves, from two coherent sources passing the same point, reinforce or cancel each other. Coherent sources of waves, produce waves of the same frequency, and a constant phase difference. When water in a ripple tank is disturbed by two coherent sources, the uniform pattern of ripples can be observed as shown in the diagram. The source of waves is coherent, which maintain at a constant phase difference, and same frequency. Such a pattern of ripples is produced, when water waves which are approaching each other meet and overlap. The waves are said to be undergoing superposition, and the phenomenon produced is known as interference. The principle of superposition states, that the resultant displacement at any point where two similar waves cross, is equal to the sum of the separate displacements of the two waves. Wave interference occur, when two waves that are traveling in opposite directions meet. The two waves pass through each other, and this affects their amplitude. There are two types of interference, constructive interference, and destructive interference. Constructive interference occurs when the crests, or highest points, of one wave overlap the crests of the other wave as shown in the diagram. As the waves pass through each other, the crests combine to produce a wave with greater amplitude. Destructive interference occurs, when the crests of one wave overlap the troughs, or lowest points, of another wave as shown in the diagram. As the waves pass through each other, the crests and troughs cancel each other, out to produce a wave with zero amplitude. In the ripple tank experiment for studying interference of waves, the spherical dippers can be used to produce coherent sources. Antennal lines consisting of maximum crest and maximum troughs, when constructive interference occurs. It's a line consisting entirely antinodes. Nodal lines consisting of points with zero displacement, when destructive interference occurs. It's a line consisting entirely of nodes. From the interference pattern, the superposition of the two sets of waves, can be studied by the following formula. The distance of separation x, between two successive antenatal lines of node align, depends on the wavelength. The distance of separation between the two coherent sources a. The perpendicular distance, from the coherent source to the position where x, is measured d. Thank you for taking time to watch this.